Our next story is a touching one that brings a whole new meaning to the phrase blood relative. My daughter was born with sickle cell anemia, but she didn't show any symptoms until she was four years old. When I first heard about Marley's diagnosis, I was pretty devastated by it. Marley started having headaches. The doctors told us that children with sickle cell tend to have headaches due to the disease. The headaches, she would just wake up screaming, Daddy, my head hurt, and she would just be crying and crying. After the headaches, the doctor called us in and they told us about Marley's condition, and they said that within three years, she had a 60% chance of having a stroke. He was saying the only way that we could do anything was to have a bone marrow transplant. We asked the doctors to run the matching test on her sister, Maya, and uh, Marley and Maya were a 98% match. Marley had to undergo chemotherapy in order for her body to accept the new bone marrow that she was going to receive from Maya. It was horrible. The first regimen, she had two seizures in a day. That was the scariest day for me. You start thinking, oh my goodness, look what we're putting her through. On October 4th, 2011, she had the bone marrow transplant. After the bone marrow, I remember every day just waiting for the nurse to come in and write her numbers on the board. It was, um, it was pretty tense. I kept asking myself, did we do the right thing? I was like, I can't lose her right now. Hey, I'm Dr. Travis Stork. Press here to subscribe to the doctor's YouTube channel and press here to help reduce tension.